have a clue because I'm back in England. You just leave the ring with the right, you don't have your story, so I'm going to leave. A World War II story of survival, resilience, and redemption by Laura Hillenbrand. To try to fish. These hooks are actually a Mustad hook, but they're pre-World War II. They're like 19, I think they're late 30s. What an interesting hook that is, and um, hopefully we'll, we'll see some action on that baby. Great little drop off here, and there the fish. There we go. That's more like it. That one took the scud. Good that. Oh, got off. Well, we're gonna try that again. I can see a couple of big fish just right here in front of me. Right here in front of me. There we go. That's fish. That's a trout. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Boy, that's enough to make your day right there. Bring them right to this net. Look at that. Oh, beautiful fish. Beautiful. Okay, bud. Get you back into the water. All right, I spotted a couple of trout feeding up here a little bit, and I'm going to take off this indicator. And I'm just going to try to cast the fly to the fish and see if I can actually spot them taking underneath. So this one right in here, I'm just going to try to put the fly in front of his face. There we go, there we go. Got him. Got him. Wow. That was cool. That was really cool. Get a little bigger. Now that fly came out of his mouth as I got him in the net. So, look at that guy. 15 incher. Yeah, that fly just came out of his mouth as he was going into the net. So. Ooh, it picked up a little bit too soon. There he is, there he is. Big old brown. Come on baby, that's nice, nice. Look at that, look at that. Took the beat head. Oh, he's bleeding bleeding, which means that he's going to die. Which means that I'm taking him home. And if you do it right, it takes about oh, 10 seconds to turn a to turn a beautiful fish, beautiful trout into a uh, wonderful meal. So look at that pink meat, beautiful salmon color. It's going to be wonderful on the barbecue.